What is brucellosis? Brucellosis is a bacterial disease. It's mainly found in like cattle, dogs, things like that. This isn't really talked about like it should be. Brucellosis can actually cause problems with your female. It could actually result in stillbirth. It can result in miscarriages. It can even result uh, in, a, in a case, in some cases, to where your the, your female can never get pregnant again. She'll she'll have to be spayed. Uh, it can be very very serious. They have brucellosis tests, so you can test your dogs for brucellosis. Now, if you have a stud business and you're meeting people in person a lot um, to uh, provide your stud services, uh, just be careful. Uh, if their dog hasn't been tested for brucellosis, uh, brucellosis is actually very contagious um, and you, you can pass it to your dog. And your stud dog, you can see things like spine issues, uh, their testicles, and this is very contagious like I said. It's very, very, very rare from your dog to be, uh, for your dog to actually die from brucellosis. The only way I could think that'd be possible is if your dog has brucellosis. You never know. Um, it could probably lead to serious problems in the future if you just never knew the whole time and it just, just kept living with brucellosis. Now, if you do run into brucellosis and your dogs actually end up getting brucellosis, uh, typically you'll see vets put uh, your dogs on uh, antibiotics for six to eight weeks, somewhere around there, depending on the vet, uh, depending on actually the antibiotic they decide to go with. They might start one for four weeks and then they might do another follow-up for uh, two weeks or three weeks, however uh, your vet does it. Whenever you uh, keep your dogs, keep that area very clean on a regular basis. Uh, again, uh, if you're going out in public, you don't know random stray dogs. Don't just let your dogs go up and smell each other. I do not recommend that. You don't know what these dogs have um, and just, just be safe. I always preach this and it's very important. Uh, brucellosis is a test that, like I said, if you're doing stud business, you're meeting in public a lot, uh, it wouldn't be a bad idea to have your customer's dog tested for brucellosis uh, prior to them meeting. And that's also another way why we AI Frenchies um, and dogs in general, you know. Uh, preventing things, uh, sexual transmitted diseases, things like brucellosis. Uh, these dogs don't actually have to come in contact. Uh, we as the human just step in and do the job of actually getting the dog pregnant. So just be careful. Always think about this. From time to time, it wouldn't hurt to actually test your own dogs to make sure you know, if they've been out uh, in, in different areas, uh, if you can catch it as early as possible, um, the earlier you catch it, the better. Give them the life they deserve. Give them the quality of life they deserve because they're family. Um, and they deserve to to live that life that they uh, to live that life while they're here the short eight to twelve years or however long they live uh, the short amount of time that they live they deserve to live the best life they're like kids they're not just animals um, so just always keep that in mind now in your male in your male stud dogs this can actually prevent them from uh, being able to sire puppies and sometimes it can look completely normal. It can look completely normal. The mother can actually have the puppies also and uh, everything seems normal. But whenever she has the puppies, the puppies are actually infected with brucellosis too. So this is one of those things that you just gotta you know, think of every once in a while. Be safe, keep your dogs in a safe environment. Guys, we upload twice a week. Please be sure to hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. Be sure to let us know your opinion down below on your thoughts on this. It is uh, one of those things that's open for discussion. Uh, if you've actually ran into this, let us know your experience. Let us know videos that you wanna see. If you got some video ideas that you wanna see, uh, comment down below, uh, let us know, and we will try our best to uh, execute that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.